it or their. Det and den can be translated in two ways in English, as it or their. We always use it when det and den is a pronoun. In other words, when it replaces a noun. The tea is cold. Oh, is it? Sorry. Whose coat is that? Is it yours? It is used as an anticipatory it in sentences to avoid a long subject up front. It was surprising that so many people turned up. It's important to do the job properly. It is fun meeting new people. It is also used as dummy it when there is nothing concrete to refer to, like with weather, measurement of time, distance, dates, temperature. It is cold today. It is far to the beach. It's Wednesday today. Dummy it is also used in sentences with general environmental statements like It gets very noisy in this class. It's always boring at these meetings. It can also be used to emphasize one element in a sentence. Compare the two sentences. A thunderstorm caused the damage. It was a thunderstorm that caused the damage. When we, in Norwegian, refer to something as existing, we need to translate det with there. For example, det er et tre i hagen. There is a tree in the garden. If you can replace the verb in Norwegian with finnes, eksisterer, står, then you have to translate det with there. Det står et tre i hagen. There is a tree in the garden.